from Leighton Gaming. Up next, we got a personal for JT. We've got three gift set bundles coming your way here. As always, appreciate you so much on the support, JT. And best of luck. Let's see if I can pull some fire. Now we're talking about Moose Burgers, too. What the heck? Moose Burgers? What the heck, bro? Turtle? Yo, you guys are just talking about all sorts of weird foods right now. I have no idea what you guys are talking about. Holy cow. I'm down to try all those, but... Dude, the poor turtles. The poor turtles. Dude, you're killing the turtle for literally, like, half a pound of meat. Like, barely any meat coming off the turtle. What's going on, Zaylin? What's going on? How you doing, my friend? How you doing? All right, guys. Here's going to be your two promo cards coming out of this, guys. Two promo cards. You got Hades and you got a Mulan. Both rares. Or, excuse me. One's going to be a super rare and one's going to be a rare. I just noticed that for the first time. So, Hades is going to be a rare. And then your super rare is going to be a Mulan as well. <laughs> Stop, bro. That can't be a thing, dude. They literally serve it to you in the shell. <laughs> Stop, bro. I don't know if I believe that. Oh, my God. Yes, exactly. The turtle's just running away. No! <laughs> Meanwhile, you're just, like, walking super slow behind him. Here we go, on to our first pack, JT, on to our first pack. <laughs> exactly, dead box, dead box. So sorry, man, so sorry. Gonna be a super rare, and our first Mickey Mouse on the day, I think. On that super rare non-foil here for JT. And our first pack, bro. First pack's gonna have a legend, and it's definitely, definitely gonna be a dead box here, JT. And you got a nice little Maleficent on the non-foil legend coming your way. Nice little hit there, JT, on the non-foil legend. Maleficent the Monstrous Dragon. And in the back, we've got a foiled magic broom as well. So three nice hits, three nice hits coming your way here. And already up to one legend non-foil out of the first pack. I've heard I've heard about uh, about Rattlesnake before. Don't you have to cook it in like a particular way? Don't you have to cook Rattlesnake in a particular way? Scorpion soup. All right, now you guys are just making things up. Scorpion soup. All right, uh, calm down, Viking, calm down. I think you guys are just making this up as you go now. Into our uncommons. Do it again that time. Super rare on the Taka. And a Scepter of Arendell on the Uncommon coming your way. Another nice hit. Another really nice hit. Oh, Blowfish. Okay, got you. Blowfish is the one that you have to prepare uh, in a particular way. Dude, I, I gotta try a lot of these foods. I'm I, I'm just now learning that I'm so uncultured in terms of uh, what I eat. <laughs> Grab your sword that time on the rare. Part of your world's. And it's going to be a Hakuna Matata that time on the foiled common coming your way. Cook rattle snake on a fire. Get a good char. It's still silly. <laughs> Bro. Yeah, people eat blowfish. People eat lionfish. People eat all sorts of weird stuff that can kill you when you eat it. You just got to live on the edge a little. You got to live on the edge a little. Why not, right? Poisoned apple. Hans on the super rare. And it's going to be a Hercules on the foiled common coming our way. What the heck? <laughs> Bro, the government's gonna be after you on that one. You're, you're cooking zebra steak now? Come on, come on. You're gonna have the people coming after you. Uh, we already got through your break here, Dylan. We already got through your break. That's what I've heard. That's what I've heard. I've heard lionfish is actually really, really delicious. It's supposed to be a delicacy. It's actually pretty popular in, uh, in South Florida. It's pretty popular in South Florida. Another one of those fish that you got to prepare the correct way. Otherwise, you can uh, just kill your customer that you're trying to trying to feed. I don't even know what that is, Dan. Is that an animal? I've never even heard of that before. <clears throat> exactly, Hannah. I'm with you. I'm with you. I'll take the fried chicken, please. Let me just get that chicken. I'll take some turkey or fried chicken. I don't know about the whole uh, the whole bison or the the lionfish. Lionfish is very venomous. Very, very venomous because of the quills. A lot of people step on top of the lionfish. They're like rockfish in that regard. A lot of people step on top of those fishes. They just don't see them. Nice little super rare Mickey Mouse the Artful Rogue. And a Captain Hook. Captain Hook on the foiled common. Dude, you guys are nuts. You guys are nuts. What is polk exactly, Dan? What is polk? Is that a type of fish? Cooked urchins. I've heard people eating that before. Don't you have to, like, crack them open? They're kind of like a snail that you gotta crack open. Befuddle that time. I don't think we've seen that uncommon yet. Befuddle on the uncommon. 
Nice little Merlin artwork coming our way. Spicy greens. Interesting. Is it cooked? Okay, so like turnip greens. I'm not too big on the turnip greens. They have a really, really strong taste. It's either a hit or a miss. No way. No way, JT. No way, bro. Let's go. These collection boxes. Boom, baby. Hades on the Enchanted Rare for JT. Now they're starting to come, guys. Now we're seeing some Enchanted Rares. Big time hit on Hades, King of Olympus for JT. Let's go, guys. Back-to-back -back Enchanted Rares out of back-to-back -back collection boxes. Does not get much better than that. Exactly, JT. Definitely a dead box. Definitely a dead box on the Enchanted Rare coming your way here, my friends. Woo, let's go, guys. Those cards look absolutely insane. Just like the Surge Foils, like I said. Beautiful, beautiful looking foiling. Every time you move the card around, the, uh, the foiling changes with the picture. Just absolutely gorgeous cards coming out of this, guys. And with the, uh, the alternate art with Hades reaching his hand out, too. Just looks so sick, guys. Such gorgeous looking cards coming out of Disney Lorcana here. Let me get that one into a true fit now. I want to stop handling these cards. And then we're going to check out the value on that card, too, in a second. Get this into a true fit real quick. And into a mag. I've heard about that. A lot of people eat bugs. A lot of people like to eat bugs in the other parts of the world. Sweet looking cards though here, guys. Really, really beautiful looking cards. And like I said, that's going to be a Hades. Hades for JT coming your way here. Let's check out the value on that card before we keep it going. Let's check the value out on that one. Last Enchanted Rare we hit was Genie, and he was right around $300. Hades. Hades. King of Olympus Alternate Arts. That one's going to be sitting right around $200 for this one. Right around $200 for this uh, Enchanted Rare. $193 is what they're going for right now, guys. Right around $190 to $200 on that Enchanted Rare. So that's another really solid hit. Another really solid hit here on the day, guys, from Disney Lorcana. Like I said, that's only our second Enchanted Rare on the day. We haven't been able to open any booster boxes yet. So both Enchanted Rares have come from the gift sets, guys. Both from the gift sets. And I'm with you on that, JT. I love the foiling patterns on these guys. Absolutely love the foiling patterns. Crickets at Bush Gardens. <laughs> How was that, Jess? Was that a positive experience? Love to hear about that. Nice little scar coming your way. And a Captain Hook. Captain Hook on the rare foils. One of those Captain Hooks I don't think we've seen yet. Thinking a happy thought on the Captain Hook. Nice little 5 drop. 2-5. Sweet. Yeah, gone down a little bit, but still a huge card. Huge card for sure. Every single one of those Enchanted Rares are going to be big time cards. Is the biggest hit still the Elsa? What's the biggest Enchanted Rare that we can hit currently? Oh my god, yeah. I have for sure to get through the crickets, I'd imagine so, yeah. To get through the cricket meal, I'd imagine so. Yeah, all the Enchanted Rares are going in mags today. Every single one of the Enchanted Rares are going to go in mags. Here's your jumbo promos right here. And that's going to close out that. Last two promo cards coming your way. Mint chocolate cheese? Oh, bro. That sounds disgusting, dude. That sounds absolutely disgusting. I don't know why, but the, that does not sound like a good combination, bro. Where did you have that? Where did you have that? All right, last four packs here, JT. Last four packs. Let's see what else we can do here for you. <clears throat> we do not do that here at Layton Gaming. We do not do that here at Layton Gaming, Ryan. Unfortunately, we do not do that here at Layton Gaming. I would love to, man. That would be a ton of fun, getting everyone together for a rip party. Michigan. Oh, my God. <laughs> Michigan. Holy cow. Zeus that time on the rare. Sword of the Truth. And a nice little Jasmine that time on the foiled rare coming your way here. Decent hits. Very decent hits. I've heard about that before, Emu Burgers. No, I'm with you on that, Jess. These, they're definitely weird. <laughs> they're definitely weirdos. Mint with uh, with cheese? Dude, what the heck? <laughs> Very interesting combination. Nice little super rare that time on the uh, Mickey Mouse Wayward Sorcerer. And it's going to be an Elsa on the foiled common as well. I was trying to find my, uh, so my brother has a, uh, one of the, uh, the chef hats from Ratatouille. 
with Remy that's actually inside the chef hat and the hat glows in uh and Remy actually pops out of the hats. But I wasn't able to find that hat, unfortunately. Wasn't able to find the hat, so I'll take the Remy on the shoulder. That's the next uh next best the next best thing, my goodness. Can't talk here. Keeping it going though. Ursula Shell Necklace, Cruella Deville, and it's gonna be a Simba on the foiled common to close out. Blood pancakes, my goodness. Dude, what the heck? We gotta make a, a new menu here at Layton Gaming. Super rare coming our way here. Aladdin that time on the super. And closing out with a nice little stitch on the foiled common to close out. But once again, JT crushed it. Crushed it on your gift boxes here. You got two massive hits coming your way. First hit's gonna be the uh, Maleficent on the non-foiled legend. And then after that... <laughs> You got the Hades. Hades that time on the Enchanted Rare coming your way. Like I said, foiling looks absolutely gorgeous on these cards. Absolutely gorgeous. But once again, my friend, massive congrats on those pulls. And we're going to get those cards shipped out to you. Thank you, JT. Appreciate you. Appreciate you.